Okay guys, so I'm just out here just about to do some practice and um, this, is, this is one of my tiny trainers. This one's coming in an all of weight of like around 150, 152 grams or so. And it has um, an Express LRS receiver in it. In today's video, I'm gonna be trying out Express LRS. Now this is the like full 500 Hertz packet update thing. So recently, as I'm sure you all know, Bardwell put out a video talking about how, um, how you have to run like a nightly build of OpenTX um, to get the full 500 Hertz packet rates or whatever. So that's what I have downloaded. At least I'm pretty sure it's the correct version. I followed Nick Burns's um, video or what have you. So it should be right, but that remains to be seen. Also, check this out. Upgraded goggles have work as now. Whoop, whoop. Okay, DVR is rolling. Just cam. Okay, I'm sorry if you can't really see my stick inputs, but this is the best I got because I, when I'm racing, I'm flying while sitting down because, yeah. All right, let's see what's what. It has been a long time since I've flown here. So let's, so, Whoa, that gate's hard to see. I'm not even hitting full throttle in here. It has been so long since I've flown this building, but it feels a little smoother. And there's my gate. Whoa. Feels like I'm looking up a lot, but as far as the quad goes, yeah, I think I can feel a difference. This feels a bit more reactive than what I was flying at freedom spec. I know it's not just the quad, but I know this thing flies. Whoa. And this feels pretty dang good. This feels very good. Yeah, I can feel a difference. It just feels more connected and just responsive overall. Timer one elapsed. Okay, it's been two minutes. I'm bringing it in. I could probably fly longer, but I gotta adjust my camera angle. Wow, wow. Okay, um, let me readjust my camera angle a little bit, but dang, that was, uh, that was pretty insane. Like, it just feels so much more just immediate and reactive and just, yeah, 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 yeah. I really, really, really like this. So yeah, there you go. First test of 500 hertz um is a success i mean i was running 500 hertz but according to joshua bardwell's video the whole reason why i changed my firmware on this radio is because according to him um the latest version the latest stable version of open tx um it will read the sticks at 500 hertz but it will send out a signal from the transmitter at two, 250 hertz so with this nightly build what should be happening is it should be sending out the signal at 500 hertz as well as reading my sticks at 500 hertz so yeah that felt really good felt a lot better than what i had been using so i'm gonna stick with it so anyway 
that's the video. Kind of a quick one, just a quick little test video. Thank you very much for watching, and I'm gonna fly the rest of my packs. Have a good one. Cause I